Hey guys, welcome to topic 15. In this topic, we're going to be seeing how to basically create the stairs. So as you guys can see that we had created and brought out these stairs in the last topic. Now we're going to be creating a wall mounted stairs over here. So it's very easy to do that. Let's get into it. So what you're going to do is you're going to make sure that you have taken your pull push command and you start to pull up each stair over here, 0.15 enter. And all you need to do is double click to make sure that these are going up. If they do go down, all you have to do is right click, orient faces, and then pull this one up and then double click again. Reverse faces, right click, orient faces, now pull this up and start to double click. <laughs> Ooh, bitches nerf cake. Take one. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to topic 15. In this topic, we're going to be seeing how to create stairs. And for this bungalow, we will be created. We will be creating. Take five. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to topic 15. In this topic, we're going to see how to create stairs. And for this project, we will be creating wall mounted stairs. So let's see how we can easily go ahead and create that. Now, the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to press right click and reverse the face and just right click again and orient the faces. So we have all the faces and we know that now all of them are in the same direction. I can start to pick this up by pressing 0.15 and we can go ahead and double click over here. And as you guys can see, every time I double click, we will be having these stairs coming upwards in this direction. Making sure that each one of these steps are 0.15 higher than the rest. I can now bring them all on one level. And then I can again start by raising this one up 0.15 and double clicking again. Make sure you only are double clicking the top portion and none of the sides. Once we reach the mid landing, we can again merge everything to the same level and then start picking it up again, 0.15. As you guys can see, we have reached this level where we have picked up all these stairs to create a great looking stairs. I want you guys to make sure that you guys have picked up each step. Sometimes people do forget a couple of steps in between. Once you're done with this, we can erase all these sides off. Now we will be using wall mounted stairs over here, but I will show you two types of stairs that you all can place. One will be wall mounted and one will be a concrete stairs. So let's have a look at that. So now for the wall mounted stairs, what you're going to have to do is just select all the tops over here by holding control and your cursor tool to select all of them as such. Make sure you're selecting all the surfaces. M control and copy them on the side as such. Now this will become into a concrete and this will become into a wall mounted stairs. So let's see how that is done. For the concrete stairs, I'm going to first go ahead to the first step over here and draw a straight line. But do remember your stairs has to be cleansed from all these sides. As you guys can see, I've cleansed these stairs very well from all these sides, no extra lines in the center. After that, you will join this line as such and erase this off, erase this off. So I have one slope ready. Now the second slope over here, I will be able to go from the third step over here let's say straight line and here to here i will join this line and i will erase them off so we have this slope now ready after that i will join the first step over here as you guys can see the first step one over here and from here i can take my second step line and join this line and as you all will see i have kind of created this slope over here we can give it a deeper slope as such, if you all want. 
but that's completely again up to you it's also on the structural load but since we are uh, designing only for visual for visual effects we will not be really worried about the slopes over here and I can just go ahead and push this back and we can erase this off. Now as you guys can see I've kind of created my concrete steps over here. Now I will be selecting the whole concrete stairs and making them into one single group. Now once I'm done with this we're going to be creating our wall mounted stairs over here. So each step over here will be picked up 0 0.05 enter. And now I can just give double clicks on all of these steps to bring them all up over here. That would be a five centimeter thick wooden plank for our steps. You can see I've created these steps now. I can easily go ahead, select this and make them into one single group. Now, once we have created both these stairs, we will need to place them inside. The best way to place them is I will place one group on top of the other group as such. Placing this on the top portion here. So it will be something like this. Now once you guys have done this much, using the line tool and staying outside both these groups, we will create a line which goes along this line as you can see and one line straight down from here. The minute we get this point of junction, making sure that even this line is erased off, when we get this point of junction, what we can do is select both these stairs and copy from this point. Now, just because there are blue lines coming out does not mean we can select the edges of this, as you can see. No edges can be selected. That's why we need to draw this to get a reference point over here. And I can start to move from this reference point. Now remember, while moving also, you can orbit around. Now to place this perfectly in place, we will need to have an X-ray vision of this entire bungalow. How do we get this X-ray vision? Well, all we need to do is press K. And K will let us see inside. And we can see that we need to place our bungalow, our stairs inside the bungalow over here. And once we are done with this, we can press K again to get out of this portion. And now you all can see how nicely we have placed both the different types of stairs. Whichever step is needed by all, you can right click and hide that other stair as such. And you can see how I've kind of placed now these stairs over here. Of course, the window will be going up, but we will be doing that in the following topics. I hope you guys have understood how to place these stairs. So please finish this much off and I will see you guys in the next topic. Take care.